Hi guys and girls, Miss Vaselli here with your next math flipped lesson of the week. We're going to continue talking about adding large numbers, but today we're going to look at a strategy that is called using an open number line. Yesterday we talked a little bit about adding numbers using the partial sums method. Your quest this week as a mathematician is to find the best addition strategy that works for you. So hopefully by the end of this week you can say yes. I know that partial sums, that method works best for me as a mathematician. Or you might be a person who says, you know what, I really didn't like that partial sums method. I think using an open number line is really the strategy that works best for me as a mathematician when adding large numbers. So good luck, and I hope you are successful on your quest this week. So our guiding question of today is how do you add numbers using an open number line? So if we have the two numbers 23,674 plus 12,517, how am I going to add those two numbers together using an open number line? So when we look at an open number line, um, you can see that there are no really specifics about this number line. We're not really sure where it starts, we're not really sure where it ends, and there are no lines in the middle. That is what an open number line is. An open number line is open to interpretation, and you can plug in the numbers and add different numbers as you see fit. In this lesson, you'll learn how to add multi-digit whole numbers by using an open number line. So let's review. Expanded form, we've talked about it the past couple of weeks in math, we talked about it yesterday when using the partial sums method. Um, expanded form is when you break a number down by the different values within the number. So for the number 12,517, I can see that I have a 1 in the 10,000s place, so I have 10,000, a 2 in the 1,000s place, which represents 2,000, a 5 in the 100s place, which represents 500, a 1 in the 10s place, which represents 10, and a 7 in the 1s place, which represents a 7. So you can see all those values of those numbers right there. So if we have the two numbers 23,674 plus 12,517, we've already broken that first number down um, into expanded form. So what I'm going to do when I use my open number line to add two numbers together, I'm going to start with my largest number. That 23,674 is larger than 12,517. So I'm going to start with that number over here. And then I'm going to jump on my number line and add these different values that have been broken down from this number of 12,517. So my first jump, I can see I have 10,000 here from this number, um, 12,517. So I'm going to add that first to my number here on my number line. So if I do that, I know that I will have 33,674. Now, I notice that I, when I'm using this method, I like to signify my jumps and write the number that I'm adding up here. It might work better for you if you want to write the number 10,000 down here and then add those two numbers together and then put your final sum here. That's okay too. But I know that 23,674 plus 10,000 is 33,674. And if you notice, the number in the 10,000s place is the number that changes. So my next jump, I'm going to add 2,000 um, to 33,674. So I know the number in the thousands place is going to be the number that's changing. So that number changes to 35,674 when 2,000 is added to it. So that's my next number. The next number that I'm going to add to this sum is 500. Now, if you take a look, I have a 6 in my hundreds place in this number, and I have a five in my hundreds place in this number. And so I'm thinking, I'm not gonna get an even hundred out of this. I'm gonna have to jump into the thousands place. So I know that 500 plus 500 is 1,000. So I know that 500 plus 600 is going to be 1,100. So I add on my 1,000 to my five here, and I get six and then I have 100 left over for my 1,100. So I'm left with the number 36,174. Let's keep going. I'm going to now add a 10 to this number. So 36,174 plus 10 is going to give me 36,184. My last number I'm going to add is my seven, and so I'm gonna put that right there on my number line jump, 
and I know that 36,184 plus 7 is 36,191. Let's take a look at another set of numbers and let's add them together using our open number line. So I know that my largest number here between these two numbers is 42,321. So I'm going to break this number down into expanded form which I've done here for you. You guys should be professionals at expanded form. And then I'm gonna draw my open number line. And I know that my larger number, 42,321, is gonna be the number that I'm starting with on my number line. And so then I'm just going to add these numbers up here in expanded form to this number down here on my number line. So. The first number I'm going to be adding is 10,000. So I take my 10,000, I put it up there, and I add it to my 42,321, and I get 52,321. Then I take my 5,000, which is the next number up there in expanded form, and I add it to my number line, and I add it to this number right here. So 52,321 plus 5,000 is 57,321. The next number I'm gonna be adding on my number line is 300. So 57,321 plus 300 is 57,621. After that, I add the number in the tens place, which is my nine, which has a value of 90. And I know that 57,621 plus 90 is 57,711. And lastly, I add that seven. So 57,711 plus seven is 57,718. In this lesson, you learn how to add multi-digit whole numbers by using an open number line.